guys welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here my name is abby and you're welcome to meals with abby so today's video is just going to be a cook with me and mini market haul i went to the market today i wanted to cook and i just thought to show you guys the process the items i got the prices and you know how i cook and meal prep for my family if this is something you're going to be interested in then please keep on watching also do not forget to hit the like button subscribe to my channel if you haven't and also turn on your notification bell so you get notified whenever i post new videos happy watching the fleshy part so this is the bone part this one has bones this one has flesh this is another stockfish and the final stockfish so this is all of the stockfish that i got and i have uziza leaf in here this is uziza leaf um, I'm making bitter leaf soup today, so I have bitter leaf soup here. This is bitter leaf. Oh, sorry, this is bitter leaf. No, but this is bitter leaf. I have um, yellow pepper. This is for um, the soup. I have uziza seeds. I want to use this for white soup, which I'm making maybe tomorrow, but not today or next tomorrow. I have iru because I bought okra. Where's the okra? Okay, I bought okra. I'm craving okra, so I bought local base. I'm going to make it my okra. I have some prawns, smoked prawns. This is ogiri. If you know ogiri, it's used in, um, for um, soups. This is ogiri. And then kokoyam paste because I truly don't feel. Like I'll have the strength to boil coco yam and um, blend it. So I love the coco yam paste. That's all I have in this nylon. In here, this is pepper. Half pepper. Pepper. Um, okay, I got this catfish for 500 naira each. I didn't mention it's 500 naira each. I got this Uyaoyak for 200 naira. I got this Kokoyam paste. This one is 3 500 naira. The quantity is 150 naira. This stockfish is 2500. This is quite pricey. This is 2500. These ones are 200 naira each. And this one is 500 naira. This bronze cost um, 500 naira. This costs 200 naira. This is, is it 50 naira or 100 naira? I can't remember. But this is, this is like 100 naira. So yeah, I'm just showing you guys the prices. And this pepper here, I bought the onions for 100 naira each basically. I think there are six there, so that's 600. And all of the pepper costs 1,500 naira. So in here, I have chicken. Oh yeah, this is Pomo. I, I forgot I bought this. I, I have Pomo in here. So this um, cost me 200 naira each. And I have four of them in here. So, um, then... I bought sausages, you guys. We love sausage in my house. We use this a lot. So, we got two sausages i'm going to put this in the freezer and then chicken so we have chicken in here this is chicken right here and that's all that i got so i'm just going to arrange everything and start to cook and you know yeah so let's do this family of two and one thing i do not like to buy a lot of is beans number one we don't eat it that often and number two because i don't have like a chest freezer to store things and i like to store my beans in the freezer that way there is no evil another method is to add like um chili pepper dried pepper but 
this method always works for me i just put my beans in a ziploc bag take out the air and then i'm going to throw this in my freezer it lasts without any weevil next i'll be pouring in my yellow gary into its container and as you can see the container is, is not very big but if you see the container for my regular gary you guys <laughs> it is huge because i love gary but this is where i put my yellow gary so i just um decanted that and i'm going to put that in its place For the stock fish, I'm going to be adding some salt and water into it so that it gets rid of, you know, the dirt and all of the dirt settles at the bottom. So next, I'm going to be washing my chicken and I like to use white vinegar to wash it. You can use lemon or salt. This just takes away, you know, the excess dirt and bacteria. You know, you can't take out all the bacteria from chicken, but do your best to take out as much as you can. I also like to take out the fats. We don't want extra fat in my house. So I'm just going to go ahead to wash that. And I'll also separate um, the chicken because I don't intend to cook everything today. I'm going to put some in my Ziploc bag and then I'll put the ones that I want to cook today in the pot and let it boil. You're bad for me and I know it's getting out of control Tonight I just might, I won't put up a fight I'm got to be on my own, but I'm tired of being alone Whenever I'm cooking or doing some thorough cleaning, the one thing that keeps me going is music That's why you always see me dance here and there whenever I'm cooking because it just gives that vibe you know and it just makes everything fun and not look like it's a lot of stress now for my chicken the way I get the best taste out of my chicken is I do not add water immediately when I want to boil so first I'm going to add my fresh ginger and garlic I'm going to add in the onions and I'm cooking the traditional chicken stew so I'm going to be adding thyme curry and then I'll add my seasoning powder and salt and all of that. Everything you want to add, basically, you know, you add it in the pot. But then you do not add water yet. You're going to allow this to cook in its own juice first. You see that it's going to produce a lot of water. Just put your heat on, like medium to low heat, and then cover. While my chicken is boiling, I'm going to go ahead to prepare my pepper. And you guys, I love to boil my pepper before blending. It gives an amazing flavor. The consistency is so right. And then it gives a very vibrant color. It's just all round goodness, you guys. I have a recipe on my page. I'm going to leave it in the cards or in the description box. You can check it out. My perfect pepper mix. So I'm just going to go ahead to do that now and then we'll get to boil the pepper and then blend before making After washing, I'm just going to place this on heat. I add the ginger and garlic as I always do. And I always add my tomatoes at the bottom so that, you know, it produces the juice and it doesn't stick to your pot. Even though my pot is not stick. But, you know, in case you want to do this, put your tomatoes at the bottom. Now to the chicken. You can see all the juice it produced on its own. Now I'm going to add my own water to get some more stock. And this is me dancing again to a really nice bedou. 
I'm just going to go ahead to blend the pepper and you know once you're done blending this is what we have can you guys see how beautiful this looks can you see how thick and luscious it is anyways i'll go ahead and wash the dishes because i do not like to pile up dishes when i am cooking if i leave them by the time i'm done cooking i'll mostly be tired and not have the strength to wash and i do not want to leave a heap of dirty dishes in my sink that's a no-no at this point i already started cooking i already have my bitter leaf soup on heat and then i'm going to go ahead to prepare my chicken stew the boiled pepper method actually reduces your cooking time so your stew is going to come out in time so here i already added all of my fish in case you're watching this in the future at this time there is no cash in circulation in nigeria so know that at some point in 2023 around the election period february there was no cash in circulation so i couldn't get enough proteins i was only able to get you know fish and stuff from the people that had pos meat sellers they did not allow pos so anyways i just um, added all of the fish i had a lot of fish stock fish um smoked fish catfish everything fish is in here and you know i'm going to go ahead to check on my stew they already boiled a bit i'm going to sift the um stock because i do not want all those particles in the stew anyways you guys should watch the video and enjoy the cooking process if you have any questions about the cooking process let me know in the comment section and I'll be sure to answer. Uh, yeah. I see you doing over time, let me see that. Work, 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 work. Send me up the work, 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 work. Girl, you are gonna learn, 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 learn. When I give you the work, 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 work. She joined like a desert, yeah. Me, I go out for put the work in. She said, I hope you know go hurt me, you know. Don't say your body be the tightest I give you all of my love, no debating Are you number one, only one, no the place Girl, I'm no, giving I'll... you all of me, yeah Yeah, my love is so deep, I'll be giving you all of me, yeah Cause yeah. I'm all you need, I get yeah, something you never seen, yeah So come grow with me, yeah mm -hmm. Girl, I gon' make you sing my song Just get ready for work, 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 work. Stress you, I go promise to love and protect you. Yeah. Cause early in the morning, very fun is be the name you call it. Oh, ain't going nowhere. Dala ain't going nowhere. Oh, yeah. So, what can I say? Girl, you know you got me for Guys, I am done cooking. I'm just going to go ahead to put this in a plate so that I can store it in the freezer and the refrigerator also. Like I said, you are just a family of two. So, I'm not going to leave everything out because <laughs> it's going to last a long time and i do not like to keep warming stew or soup you know all the time even when you're not consuming them so that's the end of this video guys i hope you guys really enjoyed watching me meal prep cook and my mini haul if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up share this video leave a comment in the comment section if you guys want a recipe for this bitter leaf soup let me know in the comment section also and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, stay safe and stay fabulous. God bless you.